Hello, my name is Dr. Michelle Maidenberg. Today, we're gonna to do a guided meditation on impermanence. Well, what does that mean? Our lives and things are forever evolving. We're constantly, constantly ebbing and flowing and in flux, and everything is temporary. Whether it's negative emotions or suffering, everything passes with time and it's important to have that precept that buddhist precept and understand that and really cultivate that through our lives because it leads to things like really being present in a given moment noticing things so for example um, i used to have a friend who whenever we used to go anywhere he would take a moment and say to me, stop and just notice what's around you and take in this moment right now because it's going to be out of our memory in a matter of moments, days, months. So take a really keen, deliberate and intentional moment to notice everything around us and how we feel in our hearts. And when we really think about our impermanence, it allows us to appreciate and have gratitude. It allows us to focus. It allows us to slow down. All the things that we need to integrate into our lives to have more meaningful lives. So I invite you, if you feel comfortable enough, to sit up straight and close your eyes as we do this guided meditation. And when we think about impermanence, it helps us to release fear and anxiety and embrace the constant change. The constant change to things, possessions, people, our thoughts, our feelings, our perceptions, and even our relationships. And the only thing that's constant is change. Everything lasts for a finite period of time. That's why we have the fragility of life and the need to appreciate everything we're afforded with. So as we sit here and embrace our impermanence, we can easily take on challenges. We can easily become more fully present in the moment and appreciate a thing and things and people around us. And even more deeply appreciate life's impermanent pleasures. So just notice your body here with me in this moment. Appreciating the change, the evolution that happens with each moment. Everything is transitory. impulses, our compulsions, maybe our negative emotions, our suffering, everything evolves. Nothing remains the same. And bring your attention to your breath as it comes into your nostrils and the rise of your diaphragm. And just watch the breath come in and out and just observe it the way it is without judgment. And if feelings arise or memories come to mind or plans arise in your mind, just let them go. 
There's no need to push them away. There's no need to pull them in and examine them more closely. Just let the thoughts naturally fade away and bring your attention back to your breath. Now become aware of your body. Think of its parts one by one. Your feet, your legs, your hands, your arms, your torso, your neck, your head, your eyes, your mouth your nose, your ears, and all of your skin. Begin to see the momentary changes in your body. See that your heart is beating, that there's blood coursing through your veins, that's circulating your whole body, and there's breath that's flowing in and out of your lungs. There's energy at your nerve endings leading to your fingers and your toes, to your skin, to your brain and back. Become aware the more subtle cellular changes, that your body is made of trillions of cells, each of them alive, living blood cells, skin cells, stomach and brain cells moving, changing, dying, dividing, reproducing. And all of these cells, they're each made of countless parts of themselves. They're all made of atoms vibrating, exchanging at phenomenal speeds, all evolving. Now, turn your attention to your mind your mind is also composed of countless parts, of thoughts, of perceptions, of feelings, of memories, of plans, fears, and desires. Your mind is constantly changing. Watch your mind with a distance, if you can, without trying to control your thoughts. Just observe. See how your thoughts appear and disappear. And observe them without becoming attached to them and without pushing them away. And bring your mind to the world immediately around you without needing to look at any of these things. Picture in your mind the cushion that you're seated on, the walls, the ceiling, the space around you, the objects in the room. Think of your possessions. Each of them is subject to change. Nothing lasts forever. Visualize them old, faded, broken. And see how your feelings change about these objects. And then come to the present moment to realize that change is happening all the time not just when things wear out or are destroyed, but at every instant. 
think of the people around you, the people that you know, and also your acquaintances. Each of them were born. Imagine that moment with their mother giving birth and each of them will die maybe alone, maybe with dear loved ones around them. Even at this moment, everyone is constantly changing, constantly in flux. Our relationships are changing. Think of your relationships to these people, your friendships, your partners, your job, your work relationships. These are all in flux. Somewhere out there in the world, there may be a stranger who will become our dearest friend or our teacher. And even if things don't wear out or relationships don't fall apart, our mind changes the happiness and pleasure we experience is subject to change. Our joy and excitement can be evoked and lead to connection and that too over time can change. Being aware of change helps us to realize that our current situation is also subject to change. It's also fluid. When you encounter distress or disappointment or frustration, you know that things will change. Quietly contemplate for a moment on impermanence. Let anything at all come to mind. Objects, people, relationships, our body, mind, thoughts, regrets, plans, even civilization itself. Contemplate whatever comes to mind for you particularly objects of strong emotional attachment or aversion, fear or desire. Apply the reasoning of impermanence. And when you glimpse a clear, strong sense of ever-changing nature of any of these things, let go of the clinging and holding firmly and realize impermanent itself. Reflecting on impermanence helps us to accept things as they are and to anticipate, to expect change. It allows us to diminish fear and anxiety and be present for those around us. Whatever is unpleasant or disturbing won't last forever. It might even change for the better. And whatever is beautiful or pleasing will also eventually change and disappear. So we can expect to have lasting and enduring happiness or joy. We must embrace it and honor it and notice it and savor it when those moments 
are here. So if you experience something pleasurable today, whether a great meal, walking in nature, a touch by another human being, try and be fully present with it. When I count to three, when you're ready, you could open your eyes. One, two, and three. I believe in you wholeheartedly and unconditionally. Thank you.